What's up guys and welcome back to another episode of this Southampton FIFA 16 career mode. Hopefully the players are recovered from that uh, violent physical beatdown that Arsenal brought to St Mary's because we've got a tough game first of all. We're taking on Chelsea in the Premier League. Just 10 games remaining and we are sat top with a healthy point advantage over second place. And also today, by the end of the video, we will know whether we have booked our place in the quarter final of the Champions League as we take on Sevilla in the second leg of our tie. So when picking the team for this one, I've kind of got, you know, one eye on the Sevilla second leg in mind. Even though we've got a 3-1 advantage, Champions League is still our priority this year. I want to make sure that we get through. So a lot of players have been rested. A lot of the squad is tired anyway. We've had a lot of fixtures recently. So chance for a few players here to impress that haven't had a lot of game time. Hopefully they can take the chance. Cuts inside to Delhi Alley. He's got a little bit of support. Not a lot. I'm just going to hit this. I've got space. Why has he hit that left-footed? I don't know, and I don't really care. Somehow, Courtois has been beaten by that effort. It looked to be a poor shot initially, but Deli Ali, three minutes on the clock, fires us in front. I literally have no idea how Courtois has been beaten by that. That's just shocking goalkeeping from what I can see. This angle will give us a better idea. Look, it's not that... What's he doing? Target plays the ball in to Benzia, holds off the challenge of Mikel. Kimmich in possession now. He's got Villalba ahead of him. What a ball that is. Can we make it too? Hector Villalba. This time Courtois does make the save. And it's cleared away. Cahill with the worst first touch you're likely to see. Benzia's picked up on that. He's got Berteng and Cahill for company. He squares it to Ali. Can he get his second? Delhi Ali fires us. Two goals in front. 25 minutes on the clock. Credit to Benzia putting Cahill under pressure. He forced a mistake. And we've scored again. Look at that, he could have gone alone, very unselfish just to wait for support. Ali took a touch and boom! Kimmich knocks it on to Sanchez. Oh, he's lost out to Willian. Here's Thomas Muller. What a turn that is. Completely sold the defender. We've got to get back. Good save from Trap. Muller showing his quality there. So corner to defend. Hazard with a deep cross. Doesn't really get dealt with and Muller smashes it against the post. Two chances for him in a matter of minutes. Deli Ali has done brilliantly there. Kimmich, what a ball that is, looking for Villalba. He's got one man to beat, and he's beating him. He's on his left foot, not his strongest. Lays it off to Sanchez, who has absolutely rifled that into the back of the net. What a first-time finish that was. We are completely destroying Chelsea here. Great play again from Villalba. Not quite sure how Sanchez has managed to finish it like that, under pressure. That is a superb strike on his left foot. Look at the power on that. Deli Ali, can we build an attack and look to make it four before half time? It's a good run from Ali. Knocks it inside to Kimmich as well. He's got a player supporting him in Benzia. That wasn't the best pass. Half time whistle goes. We are three up. Could have been more. Chelsea have had a couple of chances. Both of them falling to Thomas Muller. Usually very clinical in front of goal. Not so far today. Kimmich, that is a very good looking ball to find Benzia. What a touch. Oh, he's messed it up. Oh, has he? Renato Sanchez takes it off Gary Cahill, who's having a torrid afternoon at the back. Chelsea having a torrid afternoon as a team just after half-time. It's four. Benzia, that first touch was awesome. That pass was not. But Cahill just wasn't aware of Sanchez behind him. And the finish is good. We've got a corner. And we've got a man on the edge of the box. Good corner. Good. Oh, oh my word, Benzia. That volley was insane. It's just come back off the crossbar. Sanchez keeps the attack alive. Going to hit one from distance. Courtois makes the save. That would have probably been my favourite goal that I've ever scored on FIFA. The ball is just dinked to the edge of the box. Benzia meets it beautifully on the volley. And that... Oh, it's, it's a phenomenal save. I didn't know he saved that. I thought it just straight up hit the bar. But if I move the angle about a bit... Oh, Courtois... Oh, what a ball from Willian to find Thomas Muller. He's in behind the defence. We've got a lot of bodies back. He stands the ball up. John Obi Mikel heads it wide from about a yard. John Obi Mikel, what a pass that is to split the defence. Fabregas finds Willian, goes for the dink. Trap's not even off his line. Yannick Bellassi going forward. He's got Sanchez inside of him. Holds it up well. Picks out Benzia. He's got one man to beat. Little scoop turn. Kale's got back at him, but Benzia still got. Oh, what a run. Can he finish? How unlucky can you get? Off the underside of the bar. Glimpse of brilliance from Benzia, but we don't see it enough. So just over 10 minutes left. We're going to make a double change. Deli Ali, who has been superb, along with Kimmich today, are going to go off. Two players coming on for fresh legs to replace them. Jordi Classy and Taliso. 
Oh, what a challenge from Taliso. Falls to Benzia. Oh, that's a good strike. Courtois definitely beaten. So was the post. Let's hit it first time. Oh, it's bending away from goal. That is inches wide. Courtois in possession. Benzia putting him under pressure. Can he score this time? Turns his man. Oh, he's been denied. <laughs> what has that poor lad got to do to get on the score sheet? Here's Taliso. Inside to Jordi Classy. Is this the moment for Benzia? Got to volley that. Shouldn't have volleyed it. Shouldn't have volleyed it. Here's Taliso. We might not be done yet. What a crunching challenge from Van Hinkle to end the game. We've beaten Chelsea 4-0. Completely dominated. Could have been 6 or 7, to be honest. They had a few chances in the first half. Not a sniff in the second half. And that is a big confidence booster before our Champions League game. Look at that, just the one shot on target from Chelsea. They've been in decent form, climbed up to fifth, but we've put them down a peg or two. So here we go, Champions League time, second leg of the round of 16. Obviously we have a 3-1 advantage on aggregate after our performance in Spain, which is why we've decided to play a 4-2-3-1 formation today. Obviously the onus is on Sevilla to take the game to us. They're going to need to attack because they need to score three goals. I'm confident of going through, but we still need to do a job. Here's Renato Sanchez. Oh, brilliant ball through to Gonzalo Higuain. Can he finish? No, it's a really good stop from the goalkeeper, to be fair. Sevilla coming forward now with Vitolo. Oh, good footwork. Ava Benega. Oh, I thought he was going to try and pass that back. He has done now. There's the shot. And Trap pushes it behind. Bit of pressure from Sevilla early on here. Here's Vitolo. More good footwork from him. He's played quite well so far. Here's Koke, our former transfer target. Puts the ball into the box. It's not dealt with. And Ava Benega goes between the two defenders and heads it past Trap into the back of the net. Half an hour gone, we're one down. They worked it really well. It was good footwork from Benega and a really good ball into the box. Van Dijk and Veltman just didn't know Benega was there. They didn't deal with it. It's a decent finish, to be fair. A oh, great challenge from Bertrand. Deli Alley is going to take over here. What can he do with it? Can he find the back of the net like he did against Chelsea? It's a good run from Deli Alley. Really good run. Still going. Want the free kick, to be fair. He's dug an effort out while he was off balance. That free kick would have been more beneficial for us. Vitolo with a good ball down the line to find Benega. What can he do here? Puts the ball in early. Immobile with a header. Immobile, however you want to pronounce it. And Trap had to be alert to make that save. Oh, it's a loose touch. Sanchez, though, didn't make the challenge. Looked like it was going for the man more than the ball there. And we've been cut open again. Ava Benega taking on Veltman. He's beaten him. He's had the shot inches wide. Had they have scored there and made it 2-0 just before half-time, I would have been very, very nervous indeed. You can see just at the last minute, it bends away from goal. Veltman finds Ali. Finds Higuain. Holding the ball up well. Ali has run onto it. Renato has run on ahead of him. Can we get ourselves level on the night? Renato Sanchez. Was going in, looked like it was heading for the roof of the net, but the keeper tipped it over. Ward-Prowse with the in-swinging corner. Keeper comes, it's headed away, only as far as Cedric. First touch is good, second touch is good, third touch was unbelievable. I thought that was going in. I think Cedric trying his best to defend, he's done well. Half-time whistle goes. It's been an even game, Sevilla have definitely come here to attack. They believe that they can get through still from this game. They put us under a lot of pressure. We need to improve. We need to kind of get out of second gear if we're going to make sure we get through to the quarterfinal. Ava Benega finds Fernando Llorente. Oh, we've dived in and Nzonzi has got through here. It's a good turn. Need to stop this attack sooner rather than later. They've worked it well. And Nzonzi with a chance to stand the ball up. Dived in again. Hasn't worked. There's the volley from Benega. It's just flashed wide. We are under pressure here. Under severe pressure. He should be scoring from there or at least... Hitting the target, a player of his quality. He's going to get the ball back here. Can he pick out Higuain with the cross? Keeper punches it away. Bertrand's going to pick that up though. Finds Ward-Prowse. Good turn. Good ball into Carrasco. Finesses one. Carrasco inches past the post. Come on, lads. So making a double change here. Deli Ali and Sanchez coming off. They're knackered, especially after all the effort they put in in that last game. Mane and Jordi Classy coming on just for fresh legs, trying to secure this game up. Bertrand helps it on to Carrasco. Higuain has bent his run and managed to stay on side here. And if he looks up, Hector Villalba is free. It's more than looking up. He's got to play the bloody pass as well. Villalba knocks it in to Mane. Good back heel. Higuain trying to get on the end of it. And he has done very fortunately. And he's smashed it in. The first effort was an air shot. Swing and a miss. But the ball ricocheted off the defender. And then Higuain made no mistake. Doesn't really change anything though. 
two goals from Sevilla here would still put the tie into extra time. You can see how fortunate he was, Higuain, in the second effort. He's just put his foot through it. Didn't even strike that cleanly, but it's found its way in. Tremolinas knocks it on here to Fernando Llorente. I'm so glad he's out wide rather than in the middle, I think. Wow. Wow. What a move. Ava Benega at the back stick this time has found the target. He was on the stretch. Poor defensively. We've just scored. And, you know, they say you're most vulnerable when you've just scored. That pass completely confused everybody apart from Ava Benega. It's a decent finish as well. Tidy. Squeezed it in that small gap. Here's Carrasco. Finds Mane. Into Higuain. Mane continues his run. Is he going to get on the end of that? It looks like he will. Cuts back onto his right foot. Looks to find Higuain. Goes for the finesse. That would have killed it. That would have killed it off. Obviously, one more goal for Sevilla. Takes us into extra time. Higuain's effort inches from killing this tie. Throw in. Mane. Weird first touch, but it's worked well for him. Can he secure qualification? No. Off target again, but surely that's time. Ref. Ref, please. Back to trap. Just clear it. There you go. That must be it. There you go. Finally, we made hard work of it. Sevilla came here and attacked and gave us a really, really good game. Few scares. They had a lot of chances. Could easily have put three or four in the back of the net, but so could we as we were catching them on the counter. Who cares at the end of the day? We are the ones heading through to the last eight of the Champions League. Celebrations all round here at St Mary's. So another very successful episode. Our lead at the top of the Premier League sits at 12 points over second place Manchester United. We've got a game in hand on a lot of the other teams in the table as well who have played 30 games. So we're in a very, very strong position. Stoke are having a great season. They're up there in third place. That'd be great if they could stay there and secure some form of European football. Down at the bottom, QPR with just one win from 29 games. They're down. I think they are probably mathematically down as well. Norwich and Sheffield Wednesday, the other two teams in the bottom three. Sheffield Wednesday are the team that we play next in the next episode. So hopefully we can register another win and take a step closer towards retaining our title. But drop a like if you've enjoyed this episode. Guys, of course, we're in the Champions League quarterfinal as well. That is the priority. That is what we're going for. Subscribe if you are new to come back to the next episode and see how we get on. And we'll see you next time.